first find point two into six eight into four point six two point seven one into five twenty point one into four point zero five into seven two hundred eleven point zero two into four two into point eight six so you have to find the products point two into six writing two as it is and representing decimal with one and counting number of digits towards right hand side of this decimal so in this case it is only one digit therefore only one zero into six six to the twelve upon ten writing numerator as it is counting the number of zeros and placing it towards left hand side so only one place because only one zero eight into four point six eight into as it is writing four forty six here because four six was the number now representing decimal with one and counting number of digits it is only one therefore only one zero now eight six of forty eight four is carry eight for the thirty two plus four is thirty six therefore three hundred sixty eight upon ten now writing numerator as it is counting number of zeros and placing it with the number of zeros here number of zero was only one therefore only one digit placed towards left hand side of the first digit here 271 as it is representing decimal with one counting digits one two therefore two zeros into five now five ones are five five seven thirty five three carry five to the ten plus three is thirteen now divided by hundred writing thirteen fifty five as it is counting number of zeros here it is two Therefore, after two decimal places, one, two, so thirteen point five five. Fourth, two hundred one, as it is. Decimal with one, number of digits with zero, into four. Now four ones are four, four zeros are zero. Any number multiplied with zero gives you zero. Now four to the eight. Now upon ten. Writing number as it is, counting number of zeros one. Therefore, placing after one digit. Towards left hand side. Here five as it is, representing decimal with one number of digits. After that, towards right hand side are two. Therefore two zeros into seven. Five sevens are thirty five upon hundred. Writing thirty five as it is, counting number of zeros two. Therefore one two. Writing number as it is two one one zero two. Representing decimal with one number of digits two, therefore two zeros into four, four to the eight, zero, then four, then four, then eight, four to the eight. Now writing number as it is, counting number of zeros two, therefore one two. Two into as it is, writing number eighty six, decimal with one number of digits one two, therefore two zeros. Now six to the twelve, one is carry. Eight to the sixteen plus one is seventeen. So one seventy two over hundred. Writing number as it is, one seventy two. Counting number of zeros two. Therefore one two. This is your question first. Second, find the area of rectangle whose length is five point seven centimeter and breadth is three centimeter. So this is your box. You can consider it as a golden box. Then length of rectangle is 5.7 centimeter. So 5.7 centimeter is the length. Although it is a box, but since it is represented in two dimensional only, there is no height associated with it. Therefore, it is a rectangle. So this is the basic difference between a rectangle and a cuboid or a box. Whenever you view a box from top view, it appears as to be a rectangle. That is the only difference. Now, breadth of rectangle is three centimeter. Now you know very well area of rectangle is length into breadth. You multiply it. Therefore, five point seven centimeter into three centimeter. Now, centimeter centimeter will be. It will not be two centimeter. It will be centimeter square. That is centimeter into centimeter. This is what is meant by this two sign written over the unit of measurement. In case of cuboid, it will be cube. That is three. Now you multiply it. 
first forget this decimal just multiply the number 7 3 is a 21 2 carry 5 3 is a 15 plus 2 is 17 now count the decimals so here it is only one point here it is nothing so after one one so this is the second question find 1.3 into 10 36.8 into 10 153.7 into 10 and rest so we have to find multiplication of all these in this question and in this chapter we have learned that multiplication of 10 100 and 1000 leads to shifting of decimal point in the product towards right side as many times as the number of zeros appear so what does it mean it means first is 1.3 into 10 so you need not to do it with you need not to go with a long form of multiplication that is first converting it into fractions like 13 over 10 then multiplying if you are multiplying with 10 100 or any forms of zeros there is a method to do it in a fast way so what you do you just count the number of zeros and you shift words right inside that number of times in the product so let's do it so first forget this decimal just multiply 13 into 1 is 13 now number of zeros is only one so we will shift one time so one time so therefore initially we were here we moved here so what does it basically mean it means 13 whole number even if you don't write 0.0 it will suffice your purpose now here again forget this decimal just multiply 368 with 10 or 1 so let's multiply it with 1 so you get 368 now we were here we count number of 0 1 we move one places towards right so it is again here therefore 368 whole number forget decimal just multiply so 1537 into 1 is 1537 move towards one place because 1 0 so it is again a whole number now here again just multiply it with 1 forget decimal so it will be 16807 why because anything multiplied with 1 is the number back so now you count it number of zeros is 1 so you shift 1 initially we were here we shifted 1 towards right remember this is towards right hand side when multiplication occurs whereas it reverses we move left when division happens which you will learn later on now fifth so first simply multiply it with 1 you write 3110 then you record number of zeros 2 so therefore we will shift two sides so first 1 but we need another 0 here that's why we wrote 10 here so initially we were here we moved two zeros towards right hand side 1 2 1561 you read first 1561 times 1 gives you 1561 then you counted number of zeros 2 so you got to move two places so 1 but we didn't wrote 0 earlier so we have to write it in order to accommodate two digits so initially we were here so 1 2 that's why this 0 has to be written now first fall write 362 and count 2 0 so initially we were here we moved two places so one two so you need not to write here because it is a whole number 362 now here multiply with one so four three zero two four three zero seven you wrote it you have to move two places initially you were here so one two you got the complete number four three zero seven now five ones are five you you have to move one places because one zero initially you were here you moved here so it is five whole number now eight ones are eight so number of zero is one so you were here you have to move here so it will be 0.8 but as we have told earlier it is better to write zero before point towards left hand side now nine ones are nine again 
but initially you were here you have to move how much how many places two so first is one and second is two therefore you have to add this zero sign now three ones are three. First you wrote three only then count number of zeros is three so you were here that means one two so you need to add one zero here that's why you have added one zero here so what is happening now so we are moving one then two then three it can be written as 30.0 as well but you need not to write it because it is a whole number that is your third part fourth a two-wheeler covers a distance of 55.3 kilometer in one liter of petrol how much distance will it cover in 10 liters of petrol any vehicle having two wheels is termed as two-wheeler now distance covered in one liter of petrol is 55.3 kilometer given now it is simple now with 10 liters it will be able to cover more distance that is 10 times more therefore we multiply it kilometer came as it is now we wrote because we are multiplying with 10 that is what we have learned in previous question as well you first multiply the thing with 1 so 553 five, as it is and count number of zeros it is 1 therefore move one digit towards right hand side so 1 you get 553 five, initially we were here we moved one digit so we got 553 kilometer so this two wheeler will be able to cover a distance of 553 kilometer using 10 liter of petrol that's fourth fifth find 2.5 into 2.3 0.1 into 51.7 and so on so we have to find again the product of these numbers 25 over 10 you know why it came then 3 over 10 again same thing 25 3 is a 75 10 10 is a 100 now writing numerator as it is counting number of zeros 2 therefore placing at 2 places 1 2 then we have 1 over 10 then 51.7 517 over 10 multiplying 517 100 writing this thing first 517 counting zeros 2 therefore 1 2 now 2 over 10 3168 over 10 and multiply it 8 to the 16 1 6 to the 12 plus 1 is 13 again 1 2 1 is a 2 plus 1 is 3 then 3 to the 6 over 10 tens a hundred writing this number first of all then counting two zeros therefore 1 and 2 63.36 again you know it how it came and multiplication so when you multiply it you can do it in your rough it turns out to be 403 upon 100 so Writing this number 403 in two places, so 1, 2. Now, here, rather than going with this way, you can also do it simple this way. Just forget decimals, multiply this number 5 out of the 25, then count the number of decimal points. So it is 1, 2, 3. That is after decimals towards right hand side. You have to count number of digits. It came 3, therefore pointing 3. 1, two three from the last number again 112 over 10 into 15 over 100 you know why it came and multiplication when you multiply it it gives you 1680 again do it in your rough over 1000 because one two three zeros are there 1000 now writing number as it is 1680 one two three so one two three by now you have learned the basics you can do them easily here we will do it in short just forget everything these zeros doesn't make any difference however this does make so 7 to the 14 7 to the 14 one is carry so you wrote 14 then we have 2 into 1 is 2 so we have written 214 initially then we counted number of digits after decimal towards right hand side so it was 1 2 and 3 and 4 
now placing it one two three four that's why we have to introduce this zero in order to accommodate this point and this zero has to be written before point now 10.05 into 1.05 how we can multiply it by using our concepts that we have learned previously just forget decimal first we will multiply 1005 with 105 so we have written this this practice try to do multiplication in such a way so writing this thing as it is split this because we have learned it multiplication is distributive in nature so 100 plus 5 now it is very easy to multiply just write the number and fix two zeros to it we have multiplied this thing then this into this so 5 5 is a 25 then 5 zero is a 0 and 5 1 is a 5 now adding it 0 plus 5 is 5 0 plus 2 is 2 5 plus 0 is 5 and 5 plus 0 is 5 again then 1 0 so this is the required number so we write the number but the decimal part is not fixed so we will count it 1 2 3 4 you have to just count the number of decimal places these are called decimal places which are after decimal towards right hand side so 1 2 3 4 now fixing 1 2 3 4 so 10.5525 is your required number now this forget everything multiply it with 1 multiply this number with 1 the same number can be achieved because multiplication with 1 leads to same number so 101 Zero, 1 now fixing decimal counting 1 2 3 4 1 2 3 4 simple then here again we have to multiply it with 11 in previous exercises we have told you the fastest way to multiply any number with 11 so first of all you write the extreme number just forget the decimal right now you have to multiply this whole number that is 10001 with 11 just write these extreme digits as it is so we've written one one then you have to add each two digits so zero plus one is one then zero plus zero is zero then again zero plus zero is zero then we have one plus zero is one so this is the fast way of multiplication with 11. you can do it with any number when you multiply it with 11. now fixing decimals so one two three therefore one two three this makes your last question question number five 